So to start with, go into your settings and switch your phone to airplane mode. Once you've done this, you'll need to restart the power of the cord charge point and ensure the indicator light is flashing green. Please note that the network configuration setting is only accessible for 15 minutes after the power reboot. So if you leave it longer than 15 minutes, you may need to restart the charger and uh, start this process again. Go into your Wi-Fi settings and after about a minute of rebooting the charger, you should be able to find um, the hotspot. Uh, it will begin with SN100. So once you've selected the correct hotspot, uh, you can enter the password. The password is always admin123, all in lowercase, and then click on connect. If you're prompted to automatically connect to a separate Wi-Fi, um, please disregard this or uh, reject it. The smartphone can communicate with the charge point without the internet connection. The next step is to open up a web browser on your smartphone. You'll need to type in 192.168. Dot four dot one to open the network configuration page and then it will ask you to enter your uh, network pin which is the four digit code on the side of the charger and tap login. And once you're successfully logged in click on charger settings followed by switch charging mode and make sure that network mode is selected. Tap continue. At this point, the charger may reboot again. If it does, just log back in again. And once you're back to the main screen, tap on network settings. In the top drop down, select Wi Fi. From the second drop down menu, select the customer's home Wi Fi network. And enter their password um, for this network. Tap confirm. You can verify that the Wi Fi strength is either good or excellent. If the Wi Fi strength is poor, um, please either change to a different network. Um, or you can look at using the 4G connection 